Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. Since the US government issued the so-called CHIP Act, the United States has implemented a chip export control policy to China and plans to expand the scope of control, which has attracted international attention. Dutch companies are worried about damaging their interests, and the Japanese government has not taken a position yet. The United States requires its allies to increase restrictions on chip exports to China, such as Japan, the Netherlands and other countries, which has attracted global attention. This move by the United States has caused concerns in the Netherlands, Japan and other countries, and may cause a chain reaction in the global industrial chain. The article will provide an in-depth discussion of the impact of the United States' expansion of chip export controls to China on various countries and the global industrial chain, as well as the response measures of relevant countries. The United States expands chip export controls to China. Since the United States promulgated the CHIP Act, the U.S. government has frequently implemented chip export control policies against China on the grounds of national security. Recently, the United States plans to expand the scope of chip export controls to China to reduce the flow of semiconductor products to China. This move caused concern among Dutch companies, and the Japanese government remained silent for the time being. The United States requires its allies, including the Netherlands and Japan, to increase restrictions on chip exports to China, showing that the United States is taking a tougher stance against China. This move may trigger profound adjustments in the economic interests and foreign policies of countries such as the Netherlands and Japan. 1. The United States puts pressure on Dutch companies. The United States requires the Dutch government to expand restrictions on chip exports to China, paying particular attention to the exports of Dutch photolithography giant ASML. Although the Dutch government has stated that it will tighten its export policy to China, the United States still requires restrictions on commercial exchanges with China. The Dutch government faces a dilemma. It must maintain international relations while protecting local industries. Dutch companies are considering withdrawing from the Dutch market. Among them, ASML has plans to move out of the Netherlands to reduce risks in international trade. This situation may lead to the damage to the Netherlands' position in the global technology industry chain and deserves in-depth attention from the international community. 2. The Japanese government's wait-and-see attitude. The Japanese government has supported the U.S. chip export policy in recent years, but has not yet made a clear stance on this incident. Despite U.S. restrictions, sales of photoresist and other materials to China by Japanese companies are still growing. Japan's continued growth in exports to China shows its importance to the Chinese market. However, under pressure from the United States to stop the sale of key materials to China, Japan will face greater diplomatic and economic challenges. Whether Japan will follow the U.S. policy towards China this time has become the focus of international attention. 3. The United States expands chip export controls to China. The U.S. government is expanding chip export controls to China from countries such as the Netherlands and Japan, and is considering allowing countries such as Germany and South Korea 
to join its ranks. The United States plans to ask more companies to stop cooperation with China to fill its emissions in chip export control. This move may lead to major changes in the global industrial chain. Countries and companies need to pay close attention to changes in the situation and formulate corresponding response strategies. International Reaction and Industrial Impact The actions of the United States have aroused widespread concern and heated discussion in the international community. China's foreign ministry called it an act of economic bullying and warned that the US's actions would have negative consequences. If the United States insists on a tough stance, it may put tremendous pressure on itself and affect the development of its chip industry. Countries are considering how to respond to the US actions to safeguard their own interests and national development. 1. Dutch companies adjust their strategies. Dutch companies are facing risks brought by pressure from the US government and are considering withdrawing from the Dutch market and reducing business with China. Companies such as ASML may consider adjusting their strategies to maintain their competitive advantage in international trade. The Dutch government needs to carefully handle its relationship with the United States to ensure that the interests of national enterprises are protected. 2. Japanese Market Adjustment Trend The Japanese government has not yet expressed its position, but Japanese companies' exports to China are still growing despite US restrictions. Japan's dependence on the Chinese market has greatly increased, but pressure from the United States may force Japan to adjust its China policy. Japan needs to balance international relations and maintain a balance between economic development and foreign cooperation. The US chip export control policy towards China has attracted international attention and has far-reaching influence. As an important part of the global technology industry chain, countries such as the Netherlands and Japan must carefully consider how to respond to the actions of the United States. Dutch companies may face the risk of withdrawing, while Japan needs to balance domestic development and international relations. Countries around the world should unite and cooperate to jointly maintain the stability and development of the global science and technology industry chain to promote global economic prosperity. We hope that governments of all countries can make wise decisions on this matter, resolve the crisis, and jointly respond to challenges.